Very quickly, <coughs> very quickly before we get into this video, I am going to be doing a live stream today, probably, I'm going to say around 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, follow me on Twitter at underscore the old potato underscore um, to know exactly when I'm going online, but it should be around uh, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, um, and I will be doing it for a couple hours, maybe even like three four hours so definitely make sure you're at the channel turn on notifications whatever you got to do and yeah come say hi hang out with me and uh, i'll play bmx streets because i believe today is the last day um it's over the fifth uh whether it's done uh after the fifth or on the fifth i'm not sure so we're gonna be playing that tonight and yeah enjoy the video guys Hey guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new video and today, I don't know why I have these on, there's no there's no music playing, there's nothing, I'm not playing a game. Today we're going to be reading your comments I guess, um, so let's do that. So, I'm just going to answer some questions, um, give shout outs I guess, I don't know, we're just going to read, I've seen, we're just going to talk about stuff. Um, let's see here, Ryan Allison, he said I honestly enjoyed the first physics demo more than this one, he's talking about BMX streets just seemed like it wasn't as realistic but more like a game and it's still hands down the best bmx game on pc keep up the videos man i love watching thanks uh, i appreciate that and yeah bmx streets i'm gonna have to agree i did like the first demo more the only thing that i like about the new demo is that quick spin feature i was really pissed off because it took me i wouldn't have even known how to do it if it wasn't for some of you guys in the comments but yeah i really like the first one a lot more um i, f I think i could hop higher um like i could do a hop double bar and i'm not even coming close to that in in this one um the manual thing um i can't manual hop and then land a manual again unless it's a nose manual to regular manual um, which was annoying because in the last one I, I i was doing really long lines where i could manual like 180 fakie manual half cab manual and it was really fun and and now i can't do that in this demo and and honestly that pretty much ruined it for me and like you guys can probably tell them and when i'm playing it, i'm just not that stoked anymore because there's certain things about the demo that is just not working for me and the first one it was perfect like i really liked it i almost rather of them just put out the old demo or, or physics demo again as opposed to this one i mean those benches are pretty cool and you can spin really quick and all that stuff and that's cool but i'd rather be able to do the manuals and stuff and i think that's just because that's the type of riding i like i like doing all those uh, manual lines and, and combining different uh, obstacles together and, and connecting them with manuals and stuff so yeah I'm, I'm gonna have to agree with Ryan and say I kind of enjoyed the first one a little bit more as well do a flare whip um, that was a comment on BMX streets I, I'll give her a go I got spud army Xbox one you should try making planned videos like every Monday certain game or like calling the shots because i think you should put more of your own writing in and i think that would help get that out um we could do planned videos um the calling the shots see that's hard that's a hard one because i really wanted to keep that for bmx streets obviously we've done it in a couple games because i enjoyed doing it in bmx streets the other games it's it's not that i don't enjoy it but i think just because everyone's so stoked on this game because it's new that's what i like playing them on um as for putting my own writing in um it's winter still it's january 3rd i can't really ride there's not even it's not even that there's snow out. i don't even have my bike i just moved to london so i don't have my bike um in the spring for sure when i have time i don't think i'll have a lot of time since i i started school in january i don't really even get a summer um, but if I do go home, I think at one point I'm going to go home for like a week um, and then I'll definitely head to the park and I'll get some clips. I'll try to film every day, maybe, and then I can post them, uh, spread them out over a while. But yeah, I'll definitely do that. If you guys have any video suggestions, like a game you want to see every week, like if you want to see, um, I I'm planning on playing Pump BMX Plus more. I just got to set up the capture card. 
but I am planning on playing that more. If there's any other game, it doesn't have to be BMX related. Please suggest me some games that aren't BMX related. Um, I did have, I think it was Spinoza. He's been commenting lots of cool stuff on there. Uh, we'll probably see it. He said to play Matt Hoffman 2, which is another PS2 game. I don't think I've played that one, to be honest. I think I only ever played Dave Mira, but we could definitely do those kind of games. PS2 games, anything. Just I've got a PS4. If you want to see games on the PS4, just let me know what you want to see. Um, do I know when the f next full demo will? Uh, no, I don't know. I get about as much information as you guys. If you guys message them. I don't get any sort of special treatment. Um, someone told me to shut up. That's great. Um, he's a movie YouTuber. I find this really cool. This is like one of the things I love about YouTube. You're the best. Greetings from Russia. That's just like the coolest thing that someone from Russia is watching my video. Like this is so neat. Um, Pumpy Max Plus is fairly addictive, and it's so easy. I find that it's just so much fun. Um, do another calling of shots. Do 180 whip. Okay, I think I did that. Oh, 180 whip. Oh, he wanted a fakey manual. Oh, I didn't do the fakey manual on that. So sorry, MMX HD. Um, let's see. How do I get that on my tablet? Do more lines. Uh, could you do touch grind BMX? I have actually done a touch grind BMX, and I will leave a link in the description. Um, if you guys want to see more of that game. I'm not a huge fan of recording the games on my phone just because it is quite laggy. Um, it's not even that the video is laggy, but it lags when I play as well, so it's actually hard to play. Um, but if you guys want to see that, definitely just let me know. Um, I can definitely do some more mobile games. I like doing the mobile games because it's awesome because most of them are free. And that means that you guys can play them as well because not everyone has $80 to spend on a PC or PS4 game. So I like doing the mobile ones because just about anyone can play them because pretty much everyone has a phone nowadays. Um, <laughs> okay, in this video, the BMX fails reaction. I do realize that that was Harry Main and not Mark Webb. I don't know why I said Mark Webb. I don't even like... It's not that I don't like Mark Webb, but I don't watch a lot of his stuff where I watch Harry Main all the time. I don't know how I didn't realize that was Harry Main. So let's get that out of the way. I don't. I know I'm going to get more comments on that video, but I messed up. I'm sorry. Um, try faking Manny to backflip. I did try that in the last video. I've, it was hard. I think that's where I got that comment from, actually. Um, a lot of people asking on and how I film on my phone I use either the Google Play app that has a function to record or I use the YouTube gaming app I don't believe either of those are on well I know Google Play is not on iPhones but YouTube gaming I don't know I don't think it is do I ride BMX in real life I get that one quite a bit uh, yes I do I rode since I was like 12 and I'm 19 so you can do the math um, I've been riding for a while. I was I was actually progressing and doing quite well, probably until I turned about, I want to say 16, and then I got a girlfriend, <laughs> and then the following year, I, I got really into games again, because I used to play a lot of games. Um, I, I shouldn't say I really got into games, but I had a girlfriend that took up a lot of the time, and then any extra time. I was playing video games, and then I slowly, slowly slowed down, and I went from going to the skate park, cheese every day, maybe every other day, to like once a week, and then it went to once every two weeks, and yeah, and now I'm here, and I don't have a bike, which sucks, but in the spring, I will definitely make sure I get it. You are so good. Some of you guys are too nice. <laughs> I watched all the way through. Subscribe. That's crazy because that's a 33 minute video. Shout out to Andrew Lake because you watched through that whole thing. Hey, I got a shout out. Oh, here's another one Nightmare Visuals. Anyways, <laughs> I like this kid. I like this kid. Central BMX. This channel proves that big YouTubers don't have to be your favorite. And I think that's cool. And it's funny because I never really, to me, like, when I started watching YouTube, I instantly just, like, never really subscribed to anyone. And I think I said this before. I never really subscribed to anyone unless they had a lot of subscribers. And I honestly regret that because now 
I watch channels all the time. You don't see them on my main channel because I have a second. My other channel is the one I use uh, for watching videos just because there's a lot of people I'm subscribed to on there. And uh, I feel like it really limits uh, a lot of things because I do watch quite a bit of smaller channels. And um, I, I like them as much. Some of them more than like the big ones. Obviously, the best YouTube rapper is PewDiePie besides me. But there is a lot of great youtubers or or content creators whatever you want to call them that don't have a lot of subscribers and i think that's cool to see you guys say that about me it's really it makes me feel good I'm not gonna lie it's a it's pretty addictive too so tell me how much i rock <laughs> i don't know do whatever you want post on your instagram when you can't post um the only issue with that my instagram is like personal and i'm gonna say I've only got like 400 followers and I think like maybe like 10 of them know that I have a YouTube and that's that I do YouTube videos. So if I made a post, and I don't think like barely any of you guys follow me on there. So if I made a post saying I'm not posting on YouTube today, I'd probably I'd like if there was dislikes on Instagram, I would probably get dislikes. Um, if you, if there is a day I don't post, um, if anything, I would post it on Twitter maybe. If I get uh, 100 followers on Twitter, then I'll start using it more. I don't really use it that much. It just, whenever I upload a video, um, a tweet goes out saying that I've made a video. Um, but if I get like 100 followers or something, um, then I'll start using it again. I've seen like a lot of you guys having a lot of issues with the BMX streets, which sucks. Never had any issues with the last one and then so many with this one. Oh, I do need to watch Chad Gurley's edit. Maybe I'll do that after. Um, yeah, I guess that's it. Spinoza is the reason why we named the BMX Streets guy Bob, if anyone's wondering. I think I call him Bob in a video. He's Bob. Bob sucks. I don't like, I like the old Bob. But anyways, guys, I think that is it for this video. Just going through some of your comments. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Um, so yeah, planned videos or uh, if there's a, a game you want to see, this whole room is so freaking shaky. <laughs> if there is a certain game you want to see once a week, definitely let me know. I can definitely get that done for you. If you want to see PS4, computer, mobile, anything really. So uh, definitely leave a comment, let me know. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching guys. Peace. Mm-hmm. <laughs>